just weeks before the start of the games. Utahns will be cheering on one of their own as she takes to the trials in Tokyo tonight. Yeah, she's from Park City where Olympians are known to train, but most of them, they do winter sports, right? Olympic specialist Alex Cabrero live in Tokyo. This Park City native is actually hoping to make a name for herself during these Summer Olympic Games, right, Alex? That's right, Mike. You know, she grew up in Park City where almost all the kids who grow up there, they either ski or they snowboard. But when her parents bought her a bicycle and she started mountain biking, something clicked. Haley Batten was only nine years old when she entered her first competition. Now she is 22 and one of the best BMX mountain bike racers in the world. She competes later today here in Tokyo where it is one race. The winner gets gold. Many of us have similar pictures of riding bikes as a kid, but most of us don't have the pictures Haley Batten has, winning title after title in the sport. No doubt in my mind, I think growing up in Park City and in Utah was such a huge opportunity for me. It may also be because of her Park City upbringing that got her thinking about the Olympics. I think ever since I was a young girl, just like watching the Olympics on TV, I always Part of me always wanted to be there. So when Batten qualified to be on the U.S. cycling team for the Tokyo Olympics, it took a little bit for her to believe it. I think I was just in such disbelief and really it took me like going home and relaxing and being with my family to really absorb it. Her family now lives in California, but her roots are strong in Park City. In fact, after qualifying, she heard from her Park City High School mountain bike coach who told her a lot of young women are looking up to her. So they had 60 girls on their team. And when I was on the team, it was not even close. Maybe like that's like 10 times what we had. So to see that growth, that's so crazy. Almost as crazy as the past year has been. Because of the COVID pandemic and the year long delay for the Olympics, it allowed Batten to get even better. Just like I was able to develop really well and train really well over just that year's time. Enough that she's now going to the biggest competition of her life and has earned the right to call herself an Olympian. Wow, this is real, like I'm going to the Olympics, that's so crazy. And um, no, it's wild. And the weather has changed here in Tokyo. It is raining today. A lot of events have been pushed back a day or two, but this BMX race is going to happen. It happens at 3 p.m. here in Tokyo, which is midnight there in Utah. About eight hours from now is when she will get going. Of course, we will certainly let you know how she does, but no matter what she does, if she medals or not, she's going to make the United States.